Hello everyone, allow me to introduce myself. My name is Frosted Cheerios, and I am a head recruiter for Phaser Network. Uh, Phaser recently went through a bunch of changes, as all of you know. We are kind of starting off fresh in a way, and I guess you could say that we are starting over, starting anew, whatever you want to call it. But basically the main idea is that Phaser is not going anywhere. You might have heard some rumors saying that Phaser is done, no more Phaser, whatever. The website's down, unfortunately. We had some issues with that. Uh, I'm not really going to address that because it is a bit of a controversial topic, but basically the website's down. That's all you need to know. We are getting a new website, however, and I encourage you guys all to watch out for that link because I'm going to be posting it all over my channel. It's going to be all over all the Phaser channels, and it's going to be awesome. Apparently, as far as I know, the website is being coded right now. It already has been designed, um, as far as I know, and I, I think it should be awesome. It'll be nice to get a website back. I don't think there will be any forums as of right now because of all the drama that has occurred on the last couple forums, but, you know, that might be for the better, and it might actually happen in a few days, or, excuse me, not a few days, a few weeks, or a little while, we might actually get our forums back, so that would be awesome. Uh, but the, the, the main idea of this video, what I wanted to let you guys know, is that Phaser is not going anywhere, guys. We're still here. I'm still here. Yes, we have lost 95% of our staff. Um, all the people that are left on our staff are, I believe, me, Justin, um, I think... Das is still with us. Das Smalls. I think he's still a recruiter. I'm not positive on that. I'll have to check. But yes, we did lose a lot of people, and it is a bummer. I personally don't have any personal problems with any of the people that left. That's their choice, and I'm, I can't control them. But I can control me, and I can control what I do and what I choose to do. And I chose to stick with Phaser for a few reasons. First off is because I believe in Phaser, and I see the potential here. Uh, I've been told that I'm pretty good at spotting potential in certain areas. And I, I know what'll do good, and I know what won't do good. And I can tell straight away that Phaser has the right stuff to go really far. One, we've done all the right things so far. Sure, we've had a bunch of mistakes going on, but we fix them as fast and as quickly as possible. And I, I can tell through you know all the directors that have come and all the partners that have come to us through the views that we're getting. It basically reflects in all the numbers and statistics that Phaser is going to get to the level that it should be and it's going to fulfill its full potential which when it does i'm going to be there and i'm going to be laughing in all the haters haters faces and i'm going to be like yo bro you mad because phaser's sexy and massive just like my <clears throat> so anyways what i wanted to address is also the fact that you might hear a lot of rumors going around that you know phaser's trash don't join phaser it sucks don't don't even pay attention to phaser just come here come come join our network whatever you know, it's completely your choice, but I recommend still coming to Phaser, because we're still the same Phaser we were when we started. If you were interested in us before, or you were in our partnership queue before, don't leave. There's no reason to leave. We're the same company in the same network we were before. And yes, we recently did get our partnership abilities back from Broadband TV, so that's awesome. So we're up and running full scale. We are looking for new applicants for our staff. We are looking for new directors, etc., etc. Um, but so far... I, uh, things are looking good, to be honest, and I'm not too worried, Justin's not too worried, we're gonna bounce back, and we're gonna bounce back fast and hard, and so there's nothing you guys have to worry about, especially you partners and directors who haven't left yet, haven't left Phaser, and you're worried about, you know, what's going on, is Phaser done, am I not getting partnered, uh, do I not get to post videos anymore, no, don't worry about a dang thing, everything's fine. Um, really, there's not much you guys need to worry about. Us staff members, sure, we have a few things we might need to worry about that concern us a little bit. But as of right now, we're doing pretty good. And Phaser's doing pretty good. And so, as soon as the new website gets up, we're going to be full scale, up and running, posting videos as much as possible. Recruiting more and more people, getting bigger and bigger. And just growing to full scale. And hopefully we never will, never will reach a potential cap, because honestly, I think we have the potential to keep growing and keep growing. And within a year, I'd say watch out for us, because... I say, in my uh, personal opinion, of course this might be a little biased and kind of sideways, but that's besides the point. Within a year, I could safely say Phaser Network will be at 100,000 subscribers, if not more. That's just, that is a guess. That is a complete estimation. Um, I didn't think that about my channel. I thought I'd be at at least 1,000 within a year, but I'm not even there. And honestly, I don't care anymore because I'm putting a lot of time into Phaser. And honestly, I'm stressing out a lot more about things that are happening at Phaser. Well, not really stressing out, but more of putting more effort into the things that are happening at Phaser than the things on my channel, but I'm going to change that, and I'm going to work really hard on my personal channel so that I can reflect Phaser and show really what we do over here at Phaser and how we treat our partners and our staff members, and so far it's going really well. I'm really enjoying my time at Phaser. I haven't really had any bad experiences here yet, and look at this kill right here. I, I tried to drop shot him turn and get stuck on the wall. He just 
knifes me. And uh, this guy, <laughs> I, he was raging at me because I told him that he was a camper and was using them akimbos like a boss. And I told him I love him. And then, look at this, I just turned the hater straight into a lover. You'll see in a couple seconds here, he says I love you too. And it's because I turned them haters into lovers. And hopefully Phaser can do the same thing. I know it's got the potential and it's going the right direction to be able to turn all those haters into lovers. And, I don't know, maybe these haters won't turn into lovers. Maybe they'll just be jealous. Maybe they'll just be darn jelly. Look, look at this right here. Let's see that. One, two, three. Oh my goodness. Triple kill. Where's my fourth? I need... No. Ah, oh, okay. Fine. Split my quad feed. See if I care. I don't care. Actually, I do. <laughs> I wanted a quad feed. Oh, but I destroyed you with my MP9. That little thing is just... It's like a little laser gun with a suppressor. I love it. But anyways, back to the topic at hand. Um, Phaser is freaking full speed ahead from now on. All the staff and everyone is buckling down, and we're going to get things done. We're going to get crap done for days. You don't even know what's going on. Um, <laughs> actually, you probably do because I just told you. But basically, we're, we're cracking down on partnerships and directorships and getting our uploads out there and dealing with everyone. We're cracking down on it and we're going to start going full speed ahead from now on and it's going to be awesome. So I recommend you guys sit by and watch us grow or you can become a part of it. It's your choice. And honestly, again, I don't have any problems with any of you uh, people who left Phaser. Quite honestly, if you if you want to come and try to shut us down, I don't even know what you guys want to do. But <laughs> look at that sound horn for the win. But that's why you use Turtle Beaches with your computer and not just your Xbox. This is PC gameplay, by the way, if you didn't know that. This is Modern Warfare 3 on the PC. Um, it looks really good, actually. But anyways, so those of you who left Phaser, if you want to come by, drop a dislike on this video, that's up to you. But maybe you'll find it in your heart to not dislike this video and just accept it for what it is. And because of the fact that I don't really have personal problems with anyone who left Phaser, it's their choice again, like I said. I don't, I'm not going to start trash talking them or bad mouthing them because honestly they're my friends and that's, you know, that's not how I roll, that's not what I'm about. Once you're my friend, you're pretty much always my friend unless you do something personally to me that makes you not my friend, sort of dequalifies you to be my friend. And in this case, it's purely business related that these people left Phaser. That was purely their choice and as far as I know, it was almost all business related. So I don't have any problems with any of these people and I encourage you guys here at Phaser not to go start trash talking everyone. Uh, the network, which has just been started by the former Phaser members, which I'm not going to say the name of, but I, I don't want you guys to go over there and just start trash talking them, and because, I mean, networks should interact better, and basically Phaser's not going anywhere. We're going to skyrocket, and we're going to get there, and eventually, you know, it's going to be awesome when we hit that awesome number of huge subscribers and the big following that we deserve and that we are going to have. And I encourage you guys to jump on this train and become a part of it because, I mean, it's moving out of the station fast. Fast. <laughs> it's not like I said fascist. No, it's moving out of the station extremely quick. And I hope you guys will buy a ticket and jump on there. I'm just kidding. You don't have to pay for anything. But jump on this train because it's going big places. And hopefully you will enjoy the ride. And that's it for me. I've been Frosted Cheerios. And unfortunately, guys, I've got to go because I just looked at my Cheerios right now and they're honey nut. So i got to go get some Frosted ones because Frosted Cheerios are the best. So, I'll see you all later. Phaser for days, bro.